Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna be showing you guys some five must-have shades for dark skin. These are gonna be lipstick shades that you're gonna be able to wear for any occasion, any season. Out of these five shades, you'll be able to find a lipstick shade for any outfit that you're wearing. So I'm gonna go ahead and jump us straight into this video. Today's video is gonna be in collaboration with Sephora Collection. I actually did a video of all my favorite Sephora Collection products back in the day, and the cream lip stain was actually one of my favorite formulas. Always Red was one of my favorites. I was already planning on doing a video similar to this. Sephora Collection reached out and said that they wanted to collaborate on a video and I was like well I have the perfect video idea especially since they extended their cream lip stain range from 46 shades now to 90 shades which is insane their cream lip stain goes for $14 which I think is very reasonable in the world of liquid lipsticks you can eat in them you can drink in them and they won't dry your lips out one thing I love about Sephora collection is they give you quality without the hefty hefty price you can get the cream lip stains on the Sephora app or sephora.com and in store I recommend going in store because then you can swatch them and figure out which shade works for you. Follow Sephora Collection on Instagram. They're gonna be doing a giveaway soon. I'm gonna go ahead and jump us straight into this video. The first one I'm gonna be doing, obviously, is this shade that I'm wearing right now. The shade that I have on right now is Black Cherry in the number 27. I love this lipstick shade. I feel like this is my boss shade like if I feel if I'm having a meeting or anything like that this shade is what I normally would go for because it's very subtle but it still gives you that punch of color mellowed out red which you guys know red is like my favorite lipstick shade I love a bright red but sometimes bright red can be a little intimidating especially for meetings or work or anything like that so this shade is definitely a shade that I would go for if I'm going to a meeting or if I'm going to work this is also a really good shade for ball months where you, you know you get the deeper colors and this is only only one coat so with liquid lipsticks the less the better you don't want to layer it too much the most that you should ever go with these kind of lip stains is two layers because anything past that is gonna look really dry and it's gonna look really just like flaky and you don't want that because with this one layer it looks very smooth no flakes no crustiness or anything so I don't recommend going anything above two layers there are some shades that require a little bit more layering and I'll show you guys some of those here in a second because I actually have one or two of them that do require just a little bit of layering just because they're a little bit lighter than what this shade looks like right now the next shade is a nude you guys know how much I love nudes if I had to choose to have only two lipstick shades for the rest of my life it'd be a red and a nude I could live off of that for the rest of my life so this is the shade warm kiss number 82 this is actually one of the new shades that they recently added and it is like such a pretty nude. It reminds me of the nude shade that I normally wear in gloss form, just in a liquid form, which I really like. I prefer a pink mauve nude just to match my undertones a little bit better. So the next shade is a good red. I am obsessed with red. I'm pretty sure you guys already know that. Red is one of my favorite lipstick shades. I love red. It just makes me feel powerful and control. I know sometimes red can be a little intimidating, but make sure you own it and slay it and don't let anyone tell you otherwise. This is one of my favorite lipsticks to Sephora Always Red. This is one of those shades, like I was saying earlier, that you do have to layer. I, like I said, I wouldn't recommend going any more than two and you really don't need any more than two. I only have two right here. Unless you do want the more subtle red that it gives you with that first single layer, but I like a brighter red. I feel like red is one of those shades when I'm feeling like I'm not here for it, like I'm not here to do anything extra. You're only gonna get brows and lipstick or or something like that, brows, foundation, and lipstick, I always go for red because red makes me feel like I did more than I actually did. It makes me feel like I actually did a full beat, but I really didn't. So the next shade is this pretty pink shade right here. It's called Fearless Fuchsia in the number 88. This is such a pretty pink shade. It's the perfect like spring, summer months vibe, brunch time. It's something that you can throw on, especially when spring and summer comes around with all the pastel colors. I do like the way it looks right now, but if you are one of those people that likes it a little bit more muted out and not as bright, you can throw a lip liner on there and that helps mute it out just a little bit so it's not too, too bright. And then the next one is this dark purple vampy shade. It's actually called dark purple number 52. I actually really like this shade because it gives me the vampy lip vampy look without the commitment of a black lipstick this purple is actually a really good in between where you get that vampy look without the black and then without the intense black
lot. I went ahead and smoked out my eyes just a little bit just to kind of show you guys what this look like, would look like with the full like vamp look. This shade, like the darker red shade that I showed earlier, is also really good for the fall and winter months when the clothes are a little bit darker and the weather is just a little bit darker. All right, so that's all I have for today's video. I really hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Hopefully you found some new lipstick inspiration. Thank you so much to Sephora Collection for sponsoring today's video. And thank you to you guys for watching. Lots of love and I'll see you guys next time.